Baseball fans and sports fans and out of the park 22 fans, or really just out of the park baseball fans. I'm here with another game in my 1994 White Sox season. Today we will be playing on the road against the Minnesota Twins. Let's take a look at the standings as they are right now. You can see we are in third place in the AL Central at 26 and 31, 10 and a half games behind Kansas City and five games behind the Cleveland Indians. Uh, but we are three games in front of the Twins. So the Twins are having a bad season and that's who we're playing right now. Um, so uh, but we're, but we're certainly not doing as well as was expected. And we are certainly not playing as well as I would have expected the 1994 White Sox to play, but as again, as a reminder, this is out of the park baseball. I'm just the manager of the team. I'm not the general manager, and there are a lot of players on the White Sox in the, well, I don't know if there's a lot of players, but there are certainly some players on the White Sox in this version of 1994 and out of the park that are not, or were not actually on the 1994 White Sox. Um, let me get down here and uh, mute the computer. And then we will carry on. We'll carry on, carry over, and we will be ready to play the next game in our season. Uh, we're going to have Wilson Alvarez on the mound in this game against Charlie Polito. Or is it? Is it Charlie Polito? I was thinking of Charlie Paleo. So this is a Polito guy. I don't know who that is, but uh, we'll we'll find out soon enough. That's for sure. Our lineup is going to be Morgan in center field. That is a guy. I don't know if he's a made up guy or like a you know a guy who never actually made it to the majors, but did in this game. Uh, Tim Raines Jr. Rock Raines in left field, batting second. Frank Thomas at DH. The big hurt. Julio down by the schoolyard. Franco will be at first base. Robin Ventura Highway at third. Darren Jackson in right field. Ozzy Guillen at shortstop. Aron Carco Vice will be the catcher. And Joey Cora rounds out our batting average, our bat, batting lineup at second base. <clears throat> For the Twins, they're going to have uh, Chuck Knobloch at second. Then Kirby Puckett in right, Shane Mack in left, Munoz at DH, Alex Cole in center field, and he is, uh, he's got some nicks and bruises it looks like, so he'll be playing with those. Scott Leis at third base, BJ Serhoff at catcher, Darren McCarty at first base, and then uh, Sellis at shortstop. So, with that having all been said, let's get out of this game. Let's see, Chris Morgan up there, the batting against Carlos Felipe, not Charlie. Somehow I was hitting the check. But anyway, let's see if we can get another win here. 26 to 31. I'm playing in target field and in 1994. But until I downloaded the actual field from 1994, which was the method of four things, we are going to make two playing target field, which I'm fine with. One is the real stadium. In fact, I don't even know if I'm going to make that change. I did recently get some instructions from a viewer of the channel. I said a very detailed instructions on how to change it. Thank you very much, Scott, for that thing. I'm really working on this. But, right, three. Until I do, I'm going to make two. 
stadiums that are real that were in the game, I just had to insert And did we go deep again? Oh my god, this is awesome! Alright, let's take it. Uh, 
by Sickman right up the middle. Past the second base. Remember Alex Cole. Remember he had his big quick class.
Carco Bikes. Rocks Carco Bikes. The bases are loaded for none other than Joey Cora is going to play.
the innings are on the horizon. Take a look at the box score. We win that game seven to five, and we go to twenty-seven and thirty-one. The Twins drop to twenty-four and thirty-six. Take a quick look at these box scores. Gotta love these, especially Ventura. He was three for five with two RBIs, and Jackson, Darren Jackson, was two for five with two RBIs. 
And Alvarez pitched seven. He allowed 11 hits, which is quite a bit, and walked the guy. So people were all over the bases. But he only gave up three earned runs, five runs total. And then McCaskill and Ossenmacher were great in relief. So that is going to be it for me, Sportsman Z. Bob Zolke, signing off.